Yeah, yeah. I coach uh, your thoughts on the draw, please. Well, uh, you know, it is the World Cup, so there's no such thing as a as an easy draw, but uh, the best way I can uh, categorize it, it's not ideal, but it could have been better. Uh, I would have hoped that last pick would have been the Ivory Coast instead of uh, Angola, because I thought Angola was a tougher team, not that you know, Ivory Coast is, is weak by any means. Uh, but other than that, uh, you know, uh, like I said, uh, uh, it is what it is. It's um, the good thing is that now uh, we have some clarity on, on who we're playing and what kind of preparation is necessary to, to be at our best uh, come up. Coach, part of the clarity po ba yung magiging selection na po ng players? May naisip na po kayo? Yeah, obviously now uh, the next uh, phase is to take a look at the teams that we're playing and uh, to build the team and, and select the players. Uh, hopefully that we think can, can be able to compete uh, with uh, the players that are uh, that we know who are going to be in the other teams. Coach, we faced Italy before to make another package and... Uh... Yeah. Uh, well, it goes both ways. So uh, we know them; they know us as well. So there's good, there's going to be a few surprises. Uh, uh, but then, that's really going to be determined by how well we get prepared, how well we can get together, play together, and how many uh, quality tune-up games we can get before the actual Jones Cup. I think that's what's going to be uh, most important because. That's what we were able to do in 2014, right? I thought we were able to put in a very good uh, tune-up uh, preparation schedule so that when we came, when it came uh, 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 World Cup time in 2014, we were playing at a very high level. So hopefully we, we can get to that level as well. Was there any set training camps already? Yeah, we already have a couple. Uh, we'll announce it when it's finalized. Uh, middle of uh, June, uh, yeah, towards the middle of June, end of June and early June. Uh, there's no problem it's a world cup and there's, there's a lot of players that are available because all of the tournaments all over the world are going to be on hold so there's not going to be any kind of conflict with any other tournaments anywhere so uh it's really a matter now of uh, sitting down with the coaching staff and, and putting the team together but for now it's the southeast asian games first so hopefully I, I'm glad this is over. We can think about this, but uh, what's in front of us right now is first the South Asia. Coach, this is um, your second rodeo in the World Cup. Can you walk us through your headspace on navigating this second um, game in the World Cup? Um, well, it's it's uh, it's uh, uh, kind of a situation where you know, yeah, I've I've been here before. Uh, I kind of know what to expect, but then again, the game is always evolving. Our, our competition is always evolving and getting better. So uh, it is incumbent on us uh, to uh, match that, uh, to continue to be better. And so I think if we come in with a game that we brought in 2014, it's not going to be enough. We have to be much, much better. And I hope uh, that from now till then, we can find a way to really become a much better team uh, so I, I hope the whole Filipino nation is behind us in praying and supporting that we we, we put the best team for. Coach, Coach Ogis no alakas to World Cup but during the draw or before the draw were you hoping na sana hindi nyo na nakuha kung hindi nyo na no, it's not only that, but I was also looking at the other groups, right? Because it's important that our other uh, Asian competitors are in tough groups because the best Asian team is the one that goes to the Olympics. So I think China is a pretty good group. They they, they drew Ivory Coast. Uh, ah, they, they drew South Sudan. Uh, Iran, I think, was the one that drew Ivory Coast. That Those are teams that they can beat, I think. So, you know, uh, so as much as I was looking at our group, I was also looking at... Uh, uh, what are the teams that the other Asian teams uh, drew as well? Because that's going to determine who is going to be the best place Asian team. Remember, our objective here is to get to the Olympics in 2024. That's that's the goal. That's the dream. So hopefully we can uh, get a win uh, or two in, in this uh, World Cup. Give us a chance to 
qualify for the league. Don't so, think it's hard to based on the growth na growth that into the Olympics. Hindi medyo mahirap, mahirap na mahirap. Very very. Uh, Coach, could you please give us a quick, uh, maybe a couple of sentences or your impressions about your three uh, coming opponents, Angola, Dominican Republic, and Italy? Number 10, number 23, number 41. I think that's the best way to uh, describe it. Italy is number 10 in the world. Uh, Dominican is number 23, and we're basically tied with uh, Angola at 40 40. Just ask one last question, please. Uh, no, we're we're picking. We're not picking the best talent. We're picking the best uh, team. We're putting a best team together. We're not putting a group of superstars. We want to pick the best team. Thank you, coach. Thank you.